So working at a zoo as a veterinarian uh, is a fantastic job. Um, we get an incredible variety of fantastic animals that we get to treat, we get to see, we get to learn about, and we get to help. So when we need to do uh, specific procedures that might call for a specialist, we are able to do some of these procedures such as uh, simple uh, tooth removal, something like that. But when it gets a little more complicated, uh, we're unable to do endodontics or root canals. Uh, we're not really set up for that. Uh, so we do call in uh, other specialists, veterinary uh, dentists, to help us with that. A lot of times when our animals need medical attention, we bring them to the hospital, um, our veterinary team works on them, uh, whether it's a surgical procedure or just, uh, you know, for a deeper uh, development of an analysis of what is going on. But then oftentimes that animal goes back to their exhibit space and then it's the animal care staff that provides their medication on a daily basis. We have two Asian elephants at Audubon Zoo. Uh, their names are Jean and Panya. Jean is 45 years old and Panya is 54. So there is a lot of feeding definitely because they love to eat and they eat constantly. Uh, so we feed them multiple times throughout the day. Uh, they usually get a flake of hay in the morning and a couple of flakes mid-morning and they eat like hobbits do. <laughs> And, you know, like, like kids, not all of our animals want to take their medication. So we'll put it in food, we take what, you know, their, their favorite food type might be and put that medication in that and present it to them so that we ensure that they're getting the proper medication throughout the time prescribed by the veterinarian. 